Yip, 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 yip. Because this is www.arkansashowcaseradio.com show. Woohoo! Coming to you from the pandemic still of 2020. Oh, yeah. And, uh, you know, we're, we're trying to stay away and uh, we're away from the camera so the camera can't get any infection or viruses. So that's the way we work right here. <laughs> and there's still all kinds of questions out there about the pandemic and schools starting or are they not starting? It's just, we're here to give you some information. Yeah, might not be correct, but hell, what the hell, it's free! <laughs> <Because> it's <laughs> free, damn it! <laughs> because everybody always asks us, you know, if someone has a legal question, they ask us. I don't know why, or they ask us about outdoors and shit. Oh. I, 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 if, they, if they were smart, they'd talk to us about pot, that's something we know about, but no, no, it's got to be COVID-19. <laughs> and one of the questions people are asking us about jobs, Roy, people want to know certain classifications of jobs, whether they're considered essential workers or are they not essential workers? Well, because I, I, school I, just got out. Graduation just happened. People are trying to get new jobs. So they want to know how to get a little bump in their bonus well, uh, not new jobs. A non-essential person would be Trump's PR person. <laughs> you know, they know that, that job doesn't exist. <laughs> Trump I mean, is they, not they, essential. They, and they write these scripts, you know, they're over there going, Ah, he's he not even in my script. <laughs> he just, we're going to hurt, he's going to hurt God. <laughs> Biden's going to hurt God. And now people did that in the Bible. What, hurt God? Yeah, they wrestled with yeah. God. They won. cheated. <laughs> he, he, he broke their hips. <laughs> his finger. Or it might not have been his finger. <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't the Bible you were reading. That was Penthouse Forum. Yeah. But we do have a few jobs out there. What we're trying you? to get the classifications for you know y'all wanting to get out into the working world. First job, Roy, is it essential or is it not essential? <laughs> That's essential. That's well, absolutely. You know, they lose essential. a lot of money because they have to wear a mask. <laughs> <laughs> don't have to wear a condom, but you gotta wear a mask. <laughs> yeah. Well, that means the ugly people can now be hookers. Yeah, but there's certain function they can't perform wearing a mask. <laughs> <laughs> and that's a big payday right there. <laughs> I do not know of this about what you speak. Uh, now, All right, wait, wait, what wait. would you consider, and these are real jobs, so think about it when you start applying. Oh, cool. Odor sniffer, Roy. And especially in, in nursing homes. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have a choice. <laughs> nursing homes or morgues. <laughs> uh -huh. uh, That's yeah. a stinky corpse right there. <laughs> but that, that is COVID a real job. There's people out there that have to smell under armpits, uh, tell whether or not deodorant works, um, certain kinds of Fungus, I have to kind of describe ooh, in microwave. Ooh, that bird right there, it's yellow. <laughs> it's attacking me. <laughs> what the hell is that? I got a yellow bird in my yard. <laughs> it's taunting you. It's <laughs> looking at you with those beady eyes. <laughs> Undressing me. <laughs> it just took a crap on you. <laughs> yeah. So would you do that job? No. Fuck no. Well, because it's not essential. It's not. Well, I guess it could be essential if you're in the elevator. They probably need an odor <laughs> sniffer. Oh, excuse me, sir. You gotta get the fuck out. <laughs> you can't go to the first floor, second floor. You just gotta get out. What does a midget do? Yeah, he gets it. He gets the <laughs> shit right in his face. Ah, oh, really? Uh, oh man, your KY is not working. <laughs> KY? What does that have to do with smell? <laughs> That's it. on where they're putting it. Yeah, well, yeah. Because the midget would be right there. Yeah. So, but yeah, that's one of the jobs if you're wanting to go. Uh, it might be essential. Who knows? We'll find out for you. Um, What's another one? Roadkill cleaner. Yeah. Uh, well, no. Uh, yeah. I, I, I don't guess, guess it'd be a road clear. Road, road clear kill. killer. <laughs> Roadkill killer. <laughs> <laughs> I killed it twice. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, that's, that's an actual job. People go around 
and their job is to remove the dead carcasses off the freeways and highways so they don't cause more accidents. And they sell it to the restaurants? <laughs> yeah, or the, or the southern people. Southern people? Yeah, because they have, what, roadkill soup and casseroles. Haven't you ever had roadkill soup? Well, I know I haven't. <laughs> I, I, I don't eat at those restaurants, Jeff. The ones I eat at have, uh, you know, been checked by the Better Business Bureau and all that. They don't, they don't say no damn, oh, there's a mongoose. I'm going to eat him. <laughs> mongoose? <laughs> they, they How many mongooses around. have you ran over? It, it happens all the time, Jeff. I've... <laughs> birds everywhere. Yeah, Roy, the shadows are just ADD. going over this place. Yeah. Oh, son of a bitch. It's a pterodactyl. They should have bird killers. That'd be essential. Yeah. They kill my birds. <laughs> Roadkill. Think about it. Go out there. That's a horrible job. Wouldn't do. You, you can do unemployment. That's a terrible job. <laughs> That's a great job. Well, especially now. Well, not now. They don't get that extra $600. Now, there's people that were, I mean upset because they had to go back to work because they're losing that 600 bucks a week they're making more on unemployment than they were when they were working yeah. uh, they're essential you got to <laughs> go back all right so if you're wanting to get another job out there here's a good one for uh -oh. you roy oh no here it comes <laughs> i want a good one i want a real good job i think you need to be uh, a wine tester <laughs> nope that's not essential, and that's a good job. A forensic entomologist. Is that like the CSI guys? Yep, those, but they only study the maggots and flies that are on dead bodies because that uh, way they can tell how long a person's uh, been dead. Now, Jeff, that's a, that's a goddamn lie. <laughs> it There's is. There's no such thing as it a, is a maggots <laughs> forensic guy. I can't even say it. <laughs> yep, they I mean, get all the, these. school has majors of that. <laughs> School of I've Hard a, Knocks, Roy. I've got a master's in maggots. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, uh, those larvae, boy, they're not, not everybody can stutter. They don't stutter those goddamn things. <laughs> you stuck a finger up it. Up what, a maggot? Yep. <laughs> Do a prostate check on a maggot. Yeah, See, that's yeah, actually what happens. Shit up, right? That really is what happens. So they get these carcasses that have these maggots and dead flies. And they do all these <laughs> tests <vegetables>. on them. <laughs> they made it just to... <laughs> and they can tell how long a person's been dead. Sometimes they can even tell how that person died. There might be some kind of toxins in those animals. That... It's easier to just watch the cameras. They know right when they died. <laughs> the cameras? Yeah, there's cameras everywhere now. <laughs> you actually have one. Yeah, I got one right there. <laughs> so when I die and maggots start eating my face, you can either check the maggots, Roy, or you can just hey, watch the camera. You know they're just lying. They look at the maggot and go... About eight hours ago. <laughs> yeah, who's gonna question yeah. them? He's gonna come in and say, "Oh man, that's obvious. That maggot. It was at least five hours ago. You're a liar. <laughs> eight hours ago, my ass. <laughs> what maggot school did you go to? Online? <laughs> you doing it online? Did you get a come come larvae? <laughs> Uh, well, speaking of oh, coom yeah. and larvae, it's not quite larvae, but it is involving coom. Uh, <laughs> Was that a hooker again? <laughs> she they got, study it. She's got a mask on. <laughs> nope, no good with them. But if you finding your way out to the animal world and you think you okay. know that you can just help out, they need sperm extractors. They need barnyard hand jobbers. Jim, come on. <laughs> That's what they told me. Like, That's I mean, what they said, this, Roy. This is your wish list. <laughs> this is your bucket list. I want to go out there and hand bang animals. That's been my dream ever since I was a little boy to hand bang animals. <laughs> it's ever, strictly for science. Ever since I was attacked by that Boy Scout leader, after that I want to bang animals. <laughs> <laughs> You're supposed to extract, not inject. <laughs> now all the results are all mixed Best up. up. No, they're smiling, smoking a cigarette. <laughs> Roy doesn't have COVID, the, but the animals damn. are ashamed now. <laughs> they run from you. <laughs> Come here, Bessie. Uh, but yeah, there are actual people that their job is to extract the semen from the animals, like most of them are on the farm. I mean, cows, I mean, horses, 
How do you put that for your experience? <laughs> I've done it. I've been living on a farm for years, and I've always had an urge to ejaculate <laughs> mammals. <laughs> mammals are they ejaculate very easy. I'm ambidextrous. I can do it with my right hand or my left. Maybe it's a dog where you have him watch videos of Lassie. <laughs> uh, look at that. You like hey, it? Hey, look at sea biscuits right there. <laughs> well, yeah, could you imagine? I that? can't imagine. That's, That's an stupid. actual job. <laughs> you know you would do it. You've done it in college for fun. That was me. <laughs> what are you talking about? I didn't go hunting down animals in the dorm. <laughs> you putting on antlers? <laughs> Anybody out there? <laughs> Come on. Anybody? Any scientific purposes going on? But yeah, uh, so, is that essential or not essential? To the animals, it must be. Otherwise, they're all running around, all keyed up. <laughs> they need that release to make them back into the wild. Can you imagine you come on the farm, all the animals just start lining up in a single file line. <laughs> and Doctor Doolittle, my ass. Now we know how he he held his way with the animals. Yeah, he didn't talk to him. He just uh, did it. <laughs> here with some lotion. <laughs> all the animals come over. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of animal was that? <laughs> Cow. <laughs> I think you were doing it wrong, Roy. They're not saying moo moo. They're saying more, more. <laughs> oh my God! How do you explain this to your wife? Or how your was your How you, was your day? Oh, when you go to your kids' class, uh, school, you know, for uh, their jobs and everything. And here's Mr. Roy. He's and, gonna show and, you. And you kids want to get out there and get an education and go out there and just uh, ejaculate with animals. <laughs> now you just sign up right now. So I got a list right here. I know you're in sixth grade, but fuck it. Sign up right now. <laughs> get you out there as an intern. There's a waiting list. <laughs> uh, how do you flunk? How do you get fired? The animals they just keep saying they it's just never can't get there. To me before. <laughs> the animals just you can't. They just uh, don't like you. You're too rough. <laughs> you have to get a fluffer just before they come to you, <laughs> or on you. <laughs> <laughs> so I mean, do you have oh, to? No. Do you have to make sweet love, or is it just well, you've straight been sex? You've been thinking way too much about this. You, you have put to on whisper music. in their ear. <laughs> I'm <a hobby> daddy. <laughs> <laughs> how come Roy's working night shifts all the time? <laughs> and how come he's got one arm and looks like a goddamn crab? <laughs> <laughs> Animals are so tired. They don't do anything but just lay around and sleep now. <laughs> Bruck and Bacco. Bruck and, and Bronco? <laughs> oh, that was all broken. <laughs> says Bucking Bronco. Bucking Roy. Got the wrong word. Oh, okay. What else? Or you can be a urine um, analysis. You know, for zookeepers, you know, a lot of times they need to collect I mean, you got, urine. You, you got to go to the zookeeper and take their pee. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I got to pee in this. Pee on me. <laughs> I just, I just squish it out. <laughs> it's easier that way because I forgot the cup. <laughs> I got a mask on, so it, I can squeeze it out. But yeah, they actually need uh, a lot of times the urine from the animals to. Uh, test their reproductive systems. So like the orangutans, all they do is they get a big old tarp they put out there and just hopefully collect some throughout the day. Don't they do that at Opal's home too? <laughs> <laughs> and oh, we're going to have a card game. Get the mat underneath. <laughs> these old geezers will start peeing all over. There's place. Ethel. She's going. Collect it. Get it, get it, get it. Grab a funnel. Ethel, we told you where that oops, I crap my pants, but you don't. So now we got to have a plastic tarp underneath you. Damn you, Betsy. <laughs> <laughs> We're putting you out of your misery here yeah. just a little bit. Bring in the person with a COVID-19 for these people. <laughs> oh, <laughs> too soon, man. But yeah, so you can go collect pee. You can get semen. Or oh, there's more? when you're done with that, oh, you, can you can go now, take a shower. You can now check the poop because they need that as well. They need to talk about the dietary habits of some of these animals. So you can go around with an actual but, but you bag. Know, there was a famous celebrity that did that. Uh, That's Jerry Richard Springer. Gere. Jerry Springer <laughs> used to be the mayor of Cincinnati. And he got into this bad problem because he was having prostitute poop on him for pay. So th that's, how he, that's how he stopped being mayor of Cincinnati. 
<laughs> that's a shitty way to go, but that's how it went. And that was on purpose? He yeah, paid for that. He paid for that. Holy crap, I'll just shit on him for free. <laughs> oh, I mean, but what kind of person wants to do that job? Jerry Springer. <laughs> he doesn't have a show anymore. Is he still alive? He's still alive, yeah. Matter of fact, I think he still does have a show. Oh, really? Or it's, it might have been reruns. I don't know. <laughs> it's still on TV. And John Wayne, it must be a rerun. John what? Wayne's dead, too. What the hell? Uh -huh. Elvis and all that? Yeah. So we're just wanting people to know out there. So if you've got a question about what kind of field of work you want to go into, some of these jobs are some of the ones you might want to take a look into. Yeah. And, uh, you know, I mean, if, you, if you're interested in that kind of stuff, like, you know, Ejaculating animals and uh, having animals pee on you or and, poop and, or poop on you. Yeah, see a doctor. Because <laughs> you're goddamn crazy. That's that. You don't need to get paid. Right. You need to pay for therapy. <laughs> because I think we just made an executive decision. These jobs aren't essential. You're not getting a bonus for this crap. Hell no. Not gonna happen. No. no. Go COVID. To politics. <laughs> yeah, people shit on you all the time. Yeah, that's, that's where you go, and, and uh, you get paid to do it. Yep. Yeah. Done. So we just want y'all to know there are things out there. And Get a job. And stay safe out there. You know that COVID nineteen's everywhere. I mean, uh, we got people in our store, and they come in and they're not wearing a mask. Other people go, "Hey, that guy's not wearing a mask. He's not wearing a mask. What are you guys gonna do about it? That guy's not wearing a mask. It's a mannequin, sir. <laughs> yeah, it's a mannequin. <laughs> <laughs> it's a back of your head, you bastard. <laughs> I don't know what that means. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, that's it for now. You guys go out there and get those jobs and get off unemployment. And I uh, hope you find a job that suits you. And these birds, just come over and shoot them. They're everywhere over here. And go looking for animals. But check us out at www.arkansasshowcaseradio.com show. Check us out on Facebook. That's Arkansas Showcase. LinkedIn, YouTube. Ah, check us out. Just go to Arkansas Showcase and you'll find us. But we will talk to you all next week. Stay safe. Wear a mask. We're out of here. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.